Somebody come get her. She doesn't want to clean the kitchen. The long life noodles are out of date. <laughs> I'm feeling roasted. Hi guys, so as you probably know by now, organizing has become a part of my life. I redid my bedroom and then I reorganized and decluttered my closet. I also did my bathroom just on my stories on Instagram. We did a makeover in the kitchen and now it's time to make the kitchen functional. Woo! I know there are things in that freezer that's well over a year old, pal. Please don't drag me, Kane. Don't listen to that guy. Today, Actually, not just today because I'm just going to go shopping today and then tomorrow we're going to organize it. But today, I'm going to go buy some organizers. Don't really know what I need. Should probably write a list, but doesn't really feel like the right thing to do. So probably just going to wing it. Hmm. Anyway, let's go shopping. I thought you were walking to the shop. So why are you back here? What are you doing? You fraud. I forgot my phone. So number one, I need to get a fruit bowl because I'm currently using like the lid of a mat and basket. Do you want to get this? <laughs> okay, Kane is literally just coming at me with all this different stuff saying that I need this. This is really great. Kane doesn't even live there anymore and he's like making all the decisions, but Kane made the decision for the kitchen last time and it looked really cute. These bamboo organizers are honestly perfect, but I never measured the draw. <laughs> Me. We currently have so much stuff and no basket that I'm on wait here duty. We've got a little shopaholic over here. There's not gonna be anything else left in Kmart. Looks like she's gonna drop all of her goods. What has she got? Hey, we yeah, got the goods. I hate you. Are you actually going to say that? I got some things that are good, guys. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. And then Kane decided to order literally way too much food yet again. Mukbang. <laughs> so I did a little bit of damage, which naturally calls for holes. I got a bunch of just like small size containers because I use these all the time to organize food. This is the perfect size for me. I saw on Pinterest people using these to like put their sauces on and their condiments in their fridge and stuff or just like things in general. So I feel like I'm getting stupidly excited about like adult stuff. I got this utensil holder. If you guys watched my last like kitchen makeover video, I felt like my kitchen was a little too bright after I put the marble on it. So I felt like I needed to get some like black stuff. And I also got this little container that's gray. It looks like a candle. Yeah, it does look like a candle. If you guys haven't earned these, you probably should. These are just like perfect for like clipping together like a bag of chips. That's, that's pretty much it, honestly. They're getting cheaper. So I got some of these drawer organizers just to like test to see how big they are, but I'm definitely gonna have to go and get some more. And then I'm kind of questioning this fruit bowl. I think it's sick. Look, she's a little different. Again, if you guys watched my last video, Kane told me to buy something and I said no and then later regretted it. So when Kane told me to buy this, I was like, Sure, pal. Oh my god, we got this. I feel like this was low-key an accident. Do you? Yeah, I can't remember why we got it. I feel like I got this and then I got this and I thought I was gonna put this one back, but I got both of them, so they're both little turntables. All of the Pinterest organization people organize their like fruit and stuff in their fridge in like cute bowls and stuff like that. So I can just like imagine me having some like lemons in the fridge and like bowls like stacked up looking all aesthetic for about a week until I get sick of that and then I probably will just have empty bowls sitting in my fridge that I later take out for a really large pasta serving. It's funny because it's true. Literally. I also got these, but I got these last time. I used these to organize my pantry, but when I organized my pantry, I didn't get enough of them. So now that we're reorganizing the pantry, we got some more. That's everything. Time to begin, I guess. So excited. <laughs> Someone tell me why Kane was so excited that I bought one of these scrubby brushes that you put the dish liquid into. And he got to my house and he was like, pow, why is there no dish liquid in there yet? Do you know what's happening? <laughs> so this is my super organized kitchen. Wish I could say that I didn't organize my kitchen literally four weeks ago, but I did. And this is where we are now. So time to make it kind of cute. To kick it off, I'm going to take everything out of the pantry, bring it all out onto the bed, and then see if everything is still in date, organize it back into the containers, make some labels and ish. But this is it. Let's do it. I'm a little 
ashamed of my snacks. You honestly seem pretty organized as it is, pal. And that is everything that I can reach. <laughs> So this is pretty much all of my food. It's not the worst organization because I actually organized it a couple of months ago, but I just didn't have enough containers and stuff. Since then, like I said, I got a bunch more containers like these ones because I feel like they're just like the perfect size to organize stuff into and we're gonna put some labels on them. It's, it's gonna be great. But first things first, I'm gonna clean out all of the shelves in the pantry, just like wipe it down, make sure there's not like gross stuff there and then we'll organize. Wish me luck. It's not that bad, except for the floor. <laughs> I just found a zapper! I'm a little bag of M&M's. What? Alrighty then. Alrighty then. First things first, I feel like maybe we should go through everything and just like check the things. <laughs> so this stuff Sarah has literally is well over two years old. Yeah, like some of it is from my last apartment, which I live in. It's a Brisbane apartment, pal. <laughs> 2018 pals. Everything in the health container out of date. Yeah. I feel like that says a lot about me. <laughs> the long life noodles are out of date. <laughs> I'm feeling roasted. Because it's like went out in March, so Sarah. it was just March. Like, what what difference could a month make, really? Death. No, we couldn't. <laughs> <laughs> so dramatic. So this is everything that was out of date. In my defense, it was like flour, which I wasn't gonna throw out because for a minute there, you couldn't even buy flour at the grocery store. So really, I was trying to like have my own back. A lot of healthy things, like whatever the F this is. Guys, I have a box literally labeled healthy and everything in this box was out of date except the coconut oil. And like, does coconut oil go out of date? I couldn't find one. <laughs> coconut oil and pine nuts, wow. Never mind, the pine nuts were out of date last year. <laughs> Before all of this, I didn't realize how organized I wanted to be. I didn't realize that too. I didn't realize that I needed to be going through and checking everything because I honestly thought things had longer dates on them. I'm not gonna lie. I also did. Kind of shocked as well, pal. I didn't know that like curry went out of date. My goal is that I want everything in the pantry to be in matching containers. Is it because I just started following an Instagram page that organizes everything in really matching containers? Yeah, it is. These are the containers that everything was in. Well, not everything, but I just had a couple of random ones. And I think I can repurpose these somewhere else in my house. And then these are the containers that I was trying to put into my pantry, but I think they were like sold out and I didn't get enough of them. We finally got the goods. I'm also gonna put some more labels in it. So we're gonna put all our cans in here, all our baking stuff in here. So enjoy the time lapse. My label maker is my most satisfying thing I've ever purchased. Wow, and it is cans. <laughs> thing on TikTok and it shook me. So you have any kind of container like this. And apparently these parts here you fold together. Okay. So it's like this. Wait. And then this part there when you push it down. Oh it holds it? Goes in. Ooh! Look at that. That's so satisfying! Have a look at that. Wow. Life hacks with Kane. That's honestly super satisfying. Hold on. Come on. Woo! Life hacks with King Foster. That was incredible. I really thought with your memory that you were gonna forget the TikTok and we were just gonna be sitting there watching you do absolutely nothing. But great job, pal. You did amazing. So we got everything in their own containers now. For the most part, I feel like everything is organized. There's a couple of things that we're gonna need to work out where they're gonna go. But so far, so good. So let's put it all away. Everything is in there. I didn't even do the most. I've still got a bunch of other stuff that I need to work out where it's gonna go. We've got containers, chopping boards, some like supplements and vitamins and just random stuff. But so far, it's honestly very satisfying. And all I did was just get rid of the containers that didn't match. And of course, throughout all the food that I was hoarding that was out of date, which we don't want to talk about too much. <laughs> okay. 
pressured me into having coffee. Anyways, I didn't buy that many of these containers, but I figured that I always have my spices in the pantry. But it'd actually be kind of cool to have them next to the stove because that's where I use them. So they kind of fit in there perfectly. That's so satisfying. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> I don't even know if all of these are going to fit in here, but I can always get some more containers. This is going to be a two day video. <laughs> Why do I suck at organizing stuff in less than one day? The rest of the day is going to be these cabinets and then we'll finish off the kitchen tomorrow. Less. So my plan is for this cupboard, I kind of want to make some room because I think I want to get an air fryer But the only reason I haven't done it is because they're freaking massive and where do you even put that? So I'm thinking of moving these shelves around so I can fit an air fryer like here somewhere So let's do that I think you can tell which one the coffee cabinet is <laughs> Air fryer. That's <laughs> not easy. I better get an air fryer. <laughs> it's out of date. <laughs> it's out of date. <laughs> Stop. Honestly, y'all, I'm really not vibing with cleaning the kitchen, but it's one of those things that hopefully when I start, I feel that urge to keep going. What's that thing called? Is it motivation, is it? What's that? Yeah, I don't know her. On the real, your goal is just feeling a little weird today. It's like raining and I just have something really stressful happening in my life right now, but we're gonna clean the kitchen. So first things first. We have all of these cupboards down here that honestly, this one, Specifically, I told Kane that I don't think I want to organize because I just cannot. Like, how do you organize this drawer? Like, the container drawer? Whew. So I said to Kane, I think I'm going to skip it. And he was like, no. I'm going to do it. That's so satisfying. Yeah, you did yesterday. Oh, uh, no, nah, I didn't think I did it. Mom, can I please move back home? The old school YouTuber Sarah in me doesn't want to film today because it's cloudy. I don't want to do it! Yo, old school YouTuber fully damages brains, doesn't it? Damages brains. Us, all of the lifestyle girls. I'm on the road again. That's a different song choice for you. Somebody come get her. If Kane had merch, it would say, Somebody come get her. Is it really hard? Uh, her. Cue the time lapse. Woo! Everyone's gonna think I'm so fake every time I'm like, woo, now. Let's begin. All right, then. You guys can see Kane right now. He's not here for this video. It's the clouds. This is what Kane looks like, everyone. You're stuck, aren't you, Kane? You can't get out from behind there, yeah. Update on the drawers. I didn't do it, but we have a whole drawer for lids and a whole drawer for the containers. Pal! I know. Someone You're... stop me. I know. Somebody come get him. <laughs> Kane just told me that the only way to make this drawer cute is to not buy ugly stuff. You need to calm down. This drawer's cute, y'all. <laughs> I said it in the privacy of your home. <laughs> I'm expecting it to go to everyone. I literally picked the camera up. He's like, do not record this. I'm sorry, what did you just say to me? No, I said nothing. Completely irrelevant to organizing my kitchen, but Kane just tried to tell me, because we were listening to Born in the House, that Kylie Jenner has a kid with Tiger. <laughs> did they at least date? Please tell me. Yeah, they dated, but like eight ago. <laughs> Okay, so the very last thing in my cupboards that I have to clean is under my sink. She is, she, I don't know y'all, she's not looking that cute. But we've got some containers, so it should work out. Three, two, one. Wow. <laughs> I didn't even think that worked, but this is the end. Next up is the fridge. I need to get some goods. I also really want to get stuff to make cheese boards because I just started following this TikToker that just makes grazing boards and oh, y'all, it looked freaking good. So we're gonna go to the grocery store and then as I pack the groceries into the fridge, we're gonna organize it as we go. Try and kill two birds. I don't really like that saying, I'm gonna go. Grocery shopping is out. Because I feel like it's dirty. So basically all I want to get is like produce and stuff. Oh, and my cheese stuff. Kane just reminded me. 
Kane as a gift is getting me some $80 a kilogram brie cheese. Wow, that's what the real friends are at, y'all. <laughs> from the grocery store. I honestly didn't get as much as I anticipated getting because I was being too stubborn to get a basket so I was carrying everything in my hands and things were falling and it was just a lot. So I got mostly cheese. So welcome to my cheese haul. I don't know if it's because I searched kitchen organization on TikTok but every single time I see someone organize their fridge they have a freaking cheese section. And I'm like, that seems essential. Pretty sure while you guys are watching this, I can really talk about it here because I would have like already posted it on my stories. So while you guys are watching this, I just got surgery. So <laughs> am I just gonna like I, this haul was meant to be me stocking up on stuff to eat when I'm staying at home healing, and I just got a lot of cheese. So I guess that's all I'm gonna eat. But Kane was like, oh, you're gonna love eating this really expensive cheese when you're healing. So it's $85 a kilogram. This slice costs $14. But Kane bought it for me, so it's fine. We also got some Baby Bell cheese. Honestly, because I've never had these before and I was just telling everybody about how I thought you had to eat the red part of it, like the wax, which is not true. We got some double brie, some camembert, some crackers, some more crackers. I also got this, <laughs> I just like got to the next cheese and I realized how ridiculous it is that I am literally just showing cheeses. Okay, next up, I have got this Club Cheddar Trilogy Summer Herbs Vintage Sun Dried Tomato Cheese. Um, if you're a cheese brand and you wanna send me PR or work with me, hit me up. I'll have my manager down below. I really wanna work with you. Oh! I nearly thought this wasn't cheese, but it is. I got some halloumi. But I'm also like mildly lactose intolerant. I gotta go. Just in case you wanted some perspective on how much I really did get, this is it. I've never been prouder of a purchase, to be honest. So I feel like a good place to start is to just take everything out of my fridge, wipe the fridge down. You guys may be wondering, Sarah, are you gonna do your freezer? The answer is no. <laughs> We're just gonna pretend that that doesn't exist. Let's there begin. Ain't nobody like you. Am I a basic influencer that makes banana bread? Absolutely. Cause I got high hopes. Do you want the same? Everything is out, the fridge is clean. This is what we're working with. And I found these containers that I actually already had and they have wheels on them. So I feel like I'm gonna put some like produce and stuff in these containers, which I'm honestly too excited about. This is what all the Pinterest chicks would do, so. It's been a crazy journey. I think I'm just gonna show you guys what all of this looks like tomorrow. So this is my super organized so this is what we ended up with it was honestly i really didn't want to film this in like multiple days y'all but she took three days it's fine 